I'm Seth Kay from Seth Kay Photography in Chicopee, Massachusetts, and here are a couple of wedding photography lighting tips. The equipment a professional photographer uses during a wedding is a professional SLR with interchangeable lenses and a flash, one that has a head that can rotate around. When people get their first professional level flash, one that swivels, very often the first instinct is to point it straight at the subject, although very often this can lead to unflattering light. Very often it can be very flat, it can, it can be unappealing. A way to alleviate that flat look is to bounce the flash. Pointing, pointing the flash straight up can bounce the light off the ceiling and can come back down onto your subject. That will eliminate shadows behind the subject and also give a pleasing light. Another method of bouncing light is, in addition to off the ceiling, is to bounce it off to the side or even behind you at an angle. This will make a more even illumination using the entire wall behind you as a softbox. Another way of using lighting at weddings is to use external flash, such as with this pocket wizard, which is a radio transmitter, which connects to a second one connected to this flash here. On this system here, I have the same flash I was using for the rest of the wedding with a pocket wizard connected to it. That enables the signal from the camera to get to this flash without wires. It's on a standard stand with, an, with a reflective umbrella. So when you have large groups, such as during family formals, this can light a very large group better than this can on its own. And these have been a couple wedding photography lighting tips.